Hey there, and welcome back to our kitchen. I'm Casey, one of Festival's Mealtime Mentors. Today we're creating a sweet spinoff of one of our past favorite recipes. Today we're making a lemon raspberry trifle, which is kind of a spin on the red, white, and blue trifle that we did last year. So what a trifle is, um, it's a dessert that is made from layers of cake or cake crumbs, some kind of pudding, whipped topping, and fruit. So to get started with this one, we are going to make our kind of pudding whipped topping mixture. So for this, I have um, some sweetened condensed milk um, in my bowl. To that, I'm going to add some low-fat milk. And a package of cheesecake-flavored pudding mix. You could definitely use a different flavor if you would prefer. Um, you could try like vanilla or maybe even lemon. We really like that cheesecake. And this is actually the same exact uh, whipped topping that's in our red, white, and blue trifle that we made before. So I'm just gonna whisk this together. Okay. So at this point, I'm just gonna let this set for about three to five minutes um, until the mixture is soft set. So while that's working, um, I'm gonna get started on our bread or cake over here. Today, we're going to be using lemon poppy seed cake. Uh, these are loaves straight from our bakery, which is a great time saver, um, but you could certainly make your own if you would prefer as well. So you can get these either in whole loaves or sliced, either way will work. Um, and I'm just gonna cut these into kind of bite-sized pieces, um, little cubes. I'm using a serrated knife because they work really well for kind of more delicate breads and cakes because it doesn't tug as much um, on that texture. So I'm just gonna work on slicing these until they're all cubed. Okay, so we have our lemon poppy seed cake cubed. I didn't do the full two loaves because our trifle dish is a little bit smaller. Um, so feel free to play around with the amounts of that as you need to. Um, so now at this point, we're just gonna wait for our pudding mix to set. Okay, so our uh, pudding mixture is soft set. So at this point, I'm going to add our whipped topping. We use a whole container, which I love. Uh, so I'm just going to get this in here and fold it in so that it's all nice and incorporated. Like I said before, this is the same whip topping that we use in our red, white, and blue trifle. Um, that one also, instead of lemon raspberry, it features strawberries and blueberries, and we use angel food cake uh, from our bakery instead of the lemon poppy seeds. So, Feel free to play around with those like different cakes and different fruits to kind of get your favorite combinations out of those. This looks great. This is definitely my favorite part of the trifle. You could just give me a spoon and I would go at this. Um, so this is all nice and mixed together. So now I'm going to start building the trifle. So to start, I'm going to put about a third of our lemon poppy seed cake in the bottom. Make sure if you're using a clear dish, which if you don't have one, totally fine. You can definitely make it in whatever kind of deep um, dish you might have that can kind of hold all the layers. But if you do have a clear one, it's kind of nice to be able to see all of the layers. So I try to make sure that I have some good pieces kind of sticking out of the sides because that's what you'll see. Add a couple more here. And then on top of that, I'm going to add about a third of our whipped topping mixture. And again, I'm gonna make sure to really spread that all out so that um, it reaches the sides so that I can see all of these layers. And then I'm gonna add about a third of our raspberries. We use about three containers, so basically one container per layer. Um, but again, feel free to adjust that depending on what kind of serving dish you have. So just like with the bread, uh, the cake, and the, um, the whipped topping, I'm going to kind of make sure to really get these raspberries um, on the edge of my trifle dish so that you can see that layer. 
But again, if it doesn't end up picture perfect, it's still gonna taste awesome. So now I'm gonna repeat that. We're gonna spread that whipped topping around and then to garnish, um, I have some sliced lemons along with the raspberries that I've been using. So I'm just gonna kind of, you can arrange them however you would like. I'm just gonna kind of add my raspberries in a pile in the middle. And then just kind of spread out these lemon slices around the edges. But again, however you'd like to garnish is up to you. All right, and there we have it, our lemon raspberry trifle. So make this trifle your go-to dessert this summer. To get this recipe on your phone, text LEMON to 78402. And for more recipes and resources from your mealtime mentors, visit bestfoods.com.